Hello everyone, today I'm here in Hanoi and I'm going to try some Ticho, Ticho, I think is the right pronunciation, also known as dog meat. I know that some people might feel offended, but I just want to let you know that I like to travel to new countries, I like to experience new culture, and I like to understand the people in that country and I want to be respectful also to the ones who don't want to eat it so I will let you know if you don't want to watch this video you don't have to and I would appreciate not to have any hate also for respecting the Vietnamese people that they do like to eat it and this is the name, Tit Cho Yeah. Yeah, there she is cutting the meat. Yeah, she's just slicing the portion. Oh, it's a big portion. It's a very traditional restaurant. Wait to try it. I tried last time in Korea, dog meat. Let's see how is the difference between in Vietnam and in Korea. Oh. <laughs> okay. Oh. Okay, come on. Wow, look at that. Right. It has yeah, a little bit strong smell. Yeah, it smells similar to to goat. It's huge portion. Look at the amount of meat. Okay, the skin is a bit hard. Yeah, it's tasty. This one tastes better than in Korea. It's good. Mm. I like it. I'm not sure how to eat it with this and with that. Is it like Korean style? Yeah. 
all the veggies, the dog meat, the sauce, and a lot of noodles. I don't know the price, so let's see what I pay. Okay, let's try one more. The dog meat, the noodles, and then we dip it. The lady was so helpful in explaining to me how to eat it. Mm, I forgot to put the meat. It's so good. It's also like not very, they couldn't eat it yet, but people don't complain. But some people in the West, they will, in the West, yeah, they will really, will really uh, complain about this. When, when we also eat uh, another kind of meat, so I don't think it has much sense actually. I, I used to have a dog and I love my dog and I treat my dog very well when I was a kid, but I think it's not the same like dogs that are pets or dogs that are uh, in a farm. I don't think it's the same thing. This is good. No? Huh? No? 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 Ah. Okay, beer? Beer? Okay. Beer? Beer? As for what happened? <laughs> the other guys told me beer. <laughs> oh, no. Wow, yeah. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> um, what is it? <laughs> okay. <laughs> that one? Okay. Yeah. Come on. The lady also got me <laughs> more of that meat. <laughs> I didn't order the bar. She actually got it for me. I'm actually full. I just had a, I just had a bami sandwich and two sauces and I came here and I told him let's order something small and look at all this food mm. 
No, the sauce is very, very thick. Mm. Give me this, have I don't know what it is. Like, what part? No, it's not, but it's, it's actually alright. Some Vietnamese beer. Cheers. Mm. I like it. Oh, very friendly lady. I am so happy that I met her and I don't know how much I pay. <laughs> pay like 200,000, it sounds like a lot of money, but it's actually 1 million is $18. So it's not that much. But yeah, I got so confused with the money because yeah, the, the money here is like, yeah, like you pay like 100,000, 200,000. Today I just paid a million for a Vietnamese dress, so I really, yeah, I got really confused, really confused with everything. But yeah, I got more to take home because it was a lot. It was a big portion. And yeah, guys, thank you all for watching this video. And again, if you don't know me yet, I I live in Thailand for over almost 10 years now and i just like to go to a new country experience the people the culture the food i mainly make content about food so yeah i i hope you can get to understand more about vietnamese culture by seeing this video and seeing how friendly they were and how uh yeah how, how it's just nice people very nice people in Vietnam in Hanoi I only been to Hanoi and Sapa so I only talk about where I've been <laughs> all right see you and yeah the only thing that I don't like about Hanoi is that everyone is honking all the time you can hear the honks yeah everyone is like pay, 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 pay. <laughs> that is so annoying <laughs> Hey guys, so I'm here at a very local area of Hanoi and let's see if we can get some bami. I've been having so much bami lately but I really like it. I never know how to order. Let's see. Ah, hello. <laughs> so friendly. <laughs> Yeah, Xin chào. <laughs> Hello. Hi. <laughs> Bami? Okay. With an egg. <laughs> okay. Yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay. Everything. Where, where are you from? Spain. 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 Um, which city? Madrid. Madrid. Madrid, Madrid yeah. Oh. <laughs> Hola. 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 <laughs> Hola. 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 <laughs> I love Bami. Uh, Bami. Ngong. 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 <laughs> okay. This <laughs> is delicious. Put all the sauce there. Okay. Yeah. Uh, maybe I sit over there. Oh. 
egg omelette. Hello. So yeah, I just order bami. I don't know which one I order, but let's see. I've been having so many bami lately. So hungry. This is my dinner. French inspired cuisine in Vietnam. It's cold now. It's around 13 degrees, but normally I'm in Thailand. So yeah, now it's quite cold. Bye bye. Bye bye. People are so friendly. Okay, thank you. Come on. Alright, just got my sandwich here. Good bell. <laughs> I think that is the guy face. Let's see if it's good. It's alright. Mm. Very crispy. Ah, always delicious. I think I'm gonna get fat in Vietnam. No. It's got all the pate, the cilantro, the carrot. There is not many foreigners in this district. <laughs> so everyone is staring at me. I wanna know how much is it in Vietnamese language. Kai nyai nya bao nyeo. Can you eat sabang now? Uh, Teti. Teti, okay. Come on. Mm. Wow, very delicious. And I, I only pay 20,000. So cheap. This is like less than a dollar. Yeah, 20,000 is like a little bit less than a dollar. It's so good. Welcome to Hanoi. <laughs> I'm gonna go for a for a sausage again because it was so good and I really like it. Let's see if I don't get run over. Yeah, uh, sausage. Hi. Okay. Spicy. Thirty thousand. Come on. Yeah, so let's try the sauce. I almost dropped it. It's, yeah, the, it has quite a lot of chili. Mm. As good as yesterday. Very good. The skin is really crispy. It reminds me of the German sausage, but it's also similar to the Thai sausage, but it's like a, I would say like a mixture between the German sausage and the Thai sausage, <laughs> the Vietnamese one. And it's a little, little bit sour, but normally Thai sausage, especially is some ones, they're very sour. But this one is just a little bit. Yeah, you can tell that we are in Vietnam because everyone is honking all the time. Okay, now let's see in this street. We have to be careful not to be run over. Motorbikes here go crazy. It's like so dangerous. Got popcorn. So many things. <sighs> they have a kebab here, like bami kebab. It looks like a kebab, yeah. Mm, more food. <laughs> Thanks from the restaurant. Then we have like a uh, fresh meat market. Okay, 
Okay, I think I know what I'm gonna eat last. I'm just going to go for a smoothie. Let's see what fruits that they have. Yeah, I'm so used to being in Thailand that I can order anything and here it's so complicated. Xin chào. Um, pineapple. Okay. Uh, watermelon. Okay. Mix. Okay. 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 As he's just cleaning it first. Let's see, guys, the watermelon. Wow, really good. There goes the pineapple. And he will put some ice and he will seal it. Yep. Okay. Come on. I got my chance, I feel like. I only pay like 20,000 for this. Here is so cheap. Very refreshing. For only 20,000 dong. Yeah, like, I think it's 0.7 US dollars. I think I will have to check it later. Really good. Welcome to Hanoi. <laughs>